So we're just gonna take this thing off, take these bearing caps loose, stick some tri-flow lubricant in there, and uh, give it the old CPR. So, uh, back here is the pan blower. Back in there, you have to disconnect that. So I was feeling it, and I was turning the shaft, and I noticed this shaft would turn, and that fan would stay in place. So that means there's something stuck in the blower. Typically. Yeah, we'll get lost down the chute here. Something will go down there and we'll clog up that blower. We have to take that blower apart too. But meanwhile, I've got the motor halfway out, so I'm gonna go ahead and lube this up. A couple things, we got this rip cord in there, that green rip cord wrapped around that motor shaft's what happened. That, when that wheel went bad, it left a big gap between the, where the bulkhead and the drum. 
and suck this green cord down into the motor. That may have been a whole problem right there. Okay, so I jumped the gun on that one. I was thinking that motor was froze up, but it's not. It's just this, this hoodie string. This stuff here was just wrapped around that motor inside there. And so it's all good now. I'm gonna lube it up anyway. Make sure it's all lube. Clean up this uh, bubble gum. Because those will leave black streaks on your clothes. And there's some in the basket too. Okay, so I was like to check this. Make sure that it's nice and clear. It feels pretty good. And let's give it a quick check. Comes on now. that's what i like to see that's it for today thanks for watching please rate comment and subscribe if you need any help i'll give phone advice for 25 dollars 707-443-8347